Top 10 African Billionaires Welcome future millionaires to another episode on our channel. If you are new here, welcome to Millionaire by 25 YouTube channel. The best place on the internet to get inspiration and information about wealth, success and making money online. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already so that you can be informed when we put out new amazing videos like this one. Today we would be talking about the richest people on the continent of Africa. African Billionaires. This would be the first video in a series where we discuss their wealth and journey to the top. So buckle up. Without further ado, here are the top 10 billionaires in Africa. Starting from, number 10. Koos Becker. Koos Becker is a South African billionaire with an estimated net worth of $2.2 billion according to Forbes as of April 2020. Becker has served as both CEO and chairman at Naspers, a newspaper publishing firm which he transformed into an e-commerce investor and cable TV powerhouse. He also has a lot of other investments and owns shares of other companies including investment in Chinese internet and media firm Tencent in 2001 which brought great returns. He is also a founding director of the mobile communication company MTN he received an MBA degree from Columbia Business School, graduating in 1984. Since then facing business and never turning back. Number 9. Abdul Samad Rabiu. Abdul Samad Rabiu according to Forbes has a net worth of $2.4 billion. He is the founder of Bua Group which is a Nigerian conglomerate active in cement production, sugar refining, and real estate. He is also the chairman of the Nigerian Bank of Industry. Born into a fairly wealthy family in northern Nigeria on 4 August 1960, Abdul Samad Rabiu obtained a bachelor's degree in economics at the Capital University in Columbus, Ohio, and returned to Nigeria afterward at the age of 24 to oversee the family business. Since then, the business has grown significantly, acquiring Nigerian Oils Limited and agreeing contract terms with various other companies in the process. Number 8. Nagib Sawiris. Coming in at number 8 is Nagib Sawiris. Two people from the Sawiris family make this top 10 list and that is simply amazing. Nagib Sawiris has an estimated net worth of about 3 billion United States dollars according to Forbes. Born on 15 June 1954, to the family of Anzi Sawiris, an already established businessman, Nagib Sawiris completed a diploma program in mechanical engineering from Cairo University. He also obtained a master's in technical administration from the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology Zurich, ETH Zurich, and a diploma from the German Evangelical School, Cairo, Egypt. After that, he quickly joined the family business Oriscom in 1979 and since then contributed significantly to the growth of the company. Sawiris built the railway, information technology, and telecommunications sectors of Oriscom. He has also acquired a nearly 20% stake in Australia-listed gold mining's firm, Evolution Mining and owns 20% of Toronto-listed Endeavour Minding, operating gold mines in West Africa. Number 7. Mohamed Mansur. Mohamed Mansur of Egyptian descent is a former politician and chairman of the Mansur Group which is a $6 billion conglomerate. One can argue that Mohamed Mansur was born with a silver spoon, having been born into one of the most prominent business families in Alexandria. But this man is no pushover when it comes down to his ability to make and grow wealth. Mansur gained an engineering degree from North Carolina State University in 1968, and a master's in business administration from Auburn University in 1971, teaching there until 1973. He remained active along with his two brothers in the building of the Mansur Group until he resigned in 2006. Mohamed Mansur has an estimated net worth of around $3.3 billion. Number 6. Assad Regrab. Taking our number 6 spot as Algerian billionaire Assad Regrab with an estimated net worth of about $4.2 billion according to Forbes. Assad Regrab is the CEO of Sevital Group which is the first private Algerian company to have invested in a wide variety of business sectors. It has passed significant historical milestones to achieve the size and recognition it enjoys today. Sevital is the largest private conglomerate in Algeria, with interests in the agro-food sector, retail, industry and services, and much more. Aside from Sevital, Regrab also owns the El Kabar Media Group and French-Algerian daily paper. Assad has a strong base in accounting and commercial law. Number 5. Johan Rupert. According to Forbes Africa, Johan is worth 6.5 billion US dollars, making him the second richest South African and the fifth richest man in Africa. 
Born on 1 June 1950 to the family of Anton and Huberte Rupert who were already established business people at the time, Johann Rupert is an entrepreneur and is the chairman of the Swiss-based luxury goods company Richemont and the South Africa-based company Remgro. Rupert grew up in Stellenbosch, where he attended Paul Roos Gymnasium and the University of Stellenbosch, studying economics and company law. He dropped out of the university to pursue a career in business, however, in 2004, the university awarded him an honorary doctorate in economics. Rupert is a well-rounded businessman. He started his business journey early and in the process, acquiring all skills and expertise needed to make it to the top and sustain a spot there. Number 4. Nicky Oppenheimer. A South African, born into the family of Harry and Bridget Oppenheimer on 8 June 1945, Nicky was educated at Harrow School and Christ Church, Oxford, where he read philosophy, politics, and economics, earning an Oxford MA. Most of his wealth comes from businesses surrounding diamond exploration, diamond mining, diamond retail, diamond trading, and industrial diamond manufacturing sectors. Nicky Oppenheimer has a net worth of $7.5 billion. Number 3. Mike Adenuga. Emphatically taking our number three spot as Nigerian multi-billionaire, Mike Adenuga with an estimated net worth of about $7.7 billion. Born in April 1953 to a Yoruba family in Nigeria, Mike Adenuga is yet another billionaire businessman, having his tentacles deeply rooted in the telecom industry. His company, Globacom is the second largest telecom operator in Nigeria, which also has a presence in Ghana and Benin. After banging a bachelor's degree in business administration from Oklahoma State University and Pace University, Adenuga ventured fully into the business world, dabbling into oil exploration, telecom and much more before eventually hitting the jackpot. Number 2. Nassif Sawiris. Coming in at number 2 and a younger brother to Nguyen Sawiris already mentioned on this list, is Nassif Sawiris with an estimated net worth of about $8 billion. Named as the fourth richest African in 2019 by Forbes, his net worth moved from $7.5 billion to about $8 billion in less than one year. Nassif Sawiris is a big-time businessman and has held so many important positions in several organizations. Born into the family of Anzi Sawiris in 1961, Nassif completed a bachelor's degree in economics at the University of Chicago. Since then he has served in various capacities in big organizations. Today, he is the CEO, Oriscom Construction Industries and the Executive Chairman, Aston Villa FC. Number 1. Aliko Dangote. Taking our number one spot as Nigerian business mogul, Aliko Dangote with a net worth of $10.1 billion. Dangote owns a multi-billion dollar conglomerate that isn't slowing down anytime soon. From sugar to cement production, salt, flour, real estate investing, transport, textiles, oil and gas, and even exportation of cotton, cashew nuts, cocoa and so much more. Unlike billionaires like Mark Zuckerberg, Bill Gates and a few others who have one or a few major establishments and businesses, Dan Gote has his feet in almost all worthwhile sectors in Nigeria. He was honored in January 2009 as the leading provider of employment in the Nigerian construction industry. Recently, he has also further diversified into telecommunication. His net worth reduced a little over the past one year due to a drop in prices of shares, but that didn't stop Dan Gote from retaining his spot as the richest African man for the ninth year in a row. A few honorable mentions include Patrice Matsepe with a net worth of $1.6 billion, Femi Odadola with a net worth of $1.8 billion, Isabel dos Santos with a net worth of $1.6 billion and Folorencho Alakija with a net worth of $1 billion. Do check out our video on computer skills of the future. The link will be in the description box below. Check out our other videos as well. Drop a like, we would really appreciate it because a lot of research went into the production of this video in order to deliver value to you. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. Which of the billionaires do you want a detailed biography on and a breakdown of their source of wealth? Let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Share this video. As always, stay energized.